and I have to be ready to make another movie. Yeah. Uh, you know, and then I have to have a neat idea. And I'm not in any hurry to make my last movie, <laughs> to tell you the truth. Whenever that idea comes up, you know, I'll probably start writing it. Like I said, I'm in no hurry on in, in, in that regard, especially right now, because I don't even know what I'd be writing it for. I don't even, you know, do movies the way I have always known them. Do they even exist right now? I think that remains to be seen. Well, I, I kind of would like to know what I'm writing it for, what's going on, what what is the deal. I think 10's a good number. Okay. Uh, also, I'm at that point where I think, okay, it's ready to bow off the stage, leave them wanting more. Don't make any left-handed movies. Don't make any movies for the wrong reason. Don't don't muddy up uh, 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 muddy up my filmography with a bunch of out of touch old man movies. I imagine as a filmmaker, a lot of them you go, I'm just gonna keep making movies forever. You know, like well, I it, think that's what most of them want to do. Yeah, <laughs> right. but is it hard to have the perspective of like uh, one more and then it's a great catalog and I walk away? Is it hard to leave it? I don't think so. I mean, because I've I've done everything I wanted to do. Okay. I've done everything I wanted to do. I've had just an amazing career. I've had amazing amount of luck, amazing good fortune. I had no idea that the audience would, uh, in fact, if I had to guess, I would guess that the audience wouldn't have accepted my movies. Really? And that ended up not being the case. A and it, and I've been able to work at uh, in this business at the highest level. At the highest level a, a director can, uh, can, uh, can work. I want to leave at that high level mm -hmm. and, you know uh i want i want to leave where uh a new quentin tarantino movie uh coming out is an event